Hey guys, so um, the transfer window is still on, and um, a lot of names have been have been in the air. You know, rumors and rumors. Uh, we've had a few. Here we go. Um, I think the biggest so far is um, Kieran Trippier joining Newcastle, only for him to get knocked out in the FA Cup. Well, that was just a banter of it. But I was quite surprised seeing Trippier joining Newcastle at this stage. But he's a player, and he has the right to challenge himself. Who knows who we're going to see next? Maybe Lewandowski, who said the other time that he was looking for a new challenge. Maybe we'll see him joining Newcastle. I don't know. <laughs> okay, away from the banters now, down to the real business. Um, Ensley Midland now has left Arsenal for AS Roma um, for in a loan deal, but I really don't think he's going to return. If he doesn't stay with Roma, I think he'll move to another club because uh, he hasn't really worked for him at Arsenal. He wants to play in the centre midfield position, but it hasn't really, really worked for him because, yeah. And um, another player too related to Arsenal who is also available for transfer. Uh, I know some of you would have forgotten he's still a footballer. I'm talking about Jack Wilshere. Wilshere has come out to say that he's free, he's available, and let's see if he can get a transfer. Maybe in the Championship, maybe in the League One, maybe in a foreign league. Or maybe Arsenal may just use him to sort out their central midfield crisis because as it stands, they are short in numbers in that position. And it was evident in the game yesterday against Nottingham Forest as they were kicked out. Um, also for Arsenal, they need, um, they need a striker and um, they are out looking for a striker. So names have been mentioned, Dusan Vlahovic. Um, Arsenal have been on Dusan Vlahovic for... Since the uh, as in Wenger days, since 2016, that's never been for him. But let's see if they can get him now. But the question now is, would the player want to come to Arsenal? Because he's a very hot prospect right now, and there are some bigger teams who require his services. So would he want to come to Arsenal? You know, would the project be that enticing for Vlaovic to come to Arsenal? But let's see what happens. And um, um, Alexander Isak has also been um, linked with Arsenal. A very promising player, you know, a Sweden international player. But let's see if he can come to Arsenal. Um, Isak has also been monitored by other uh, big clubs. Um, I think Man City also are looking at him. Barcelona are looking at him. But report has it that um, Ross Rosida do not want to sell the player to um, Barcelona. But it's just reports. We don't know what will happen. And um, I think Real Madrid are also, you know, looking at him too. But let's see how it pans out. And then um, the left back who has decided to leave Everton. I'm talking about Lucas Digne. Um, I think he's getting closer to join Aston Villa. So let's see how it goes. If Lucas Digne will join Aston Villa. We know Chelsea are also looking for a left back. Maybe Chelsea can just come in last minute, but... I don't know, but I just, I just believe he's going to join Aston Villa. Uh, not talking about um, Chelsea and left back um, situation, we know that they are looking to call back um, Emerson from Olympic Lyon because Emerson has been on loan in Lyon. So it's supposed to be a season long loan, but because of the need for Chelsea to get um, a left back right now, you know, Chiwell is injured and um, they have um, just Alonso right there. So they would need another left back so let's see what happens there and um, still on the transfer market Coutinho has joined Aston Villa yeah we knew that Coutinho in Aston Villa um, I, don't, I don't know what will happen about that Coutinho joining Aston Villa um, I don't know let's see how it works but on paper it's a good it's a good move um, because you look at the Aston Villa team you see Leon Bailey you see Buendia and then you see Coutinho. Yeah, it's a good way to spend the Jack Grealish money. It's a good way. And I hope um, Coutinho finds his feet again. And um, for Manchester United, um, I don't think they are going to get any player. But I think there's a few players who want to get out of the club. I mean, the way it looks, almost every player wants to leave the club. <laughs> because it was reported the other day that 17 players in Man United were unhappy. Allegedly. So, um, I, Amba Diallo, I think is going to be close to joining Birmingham City on loan and I'm um, also um, Anthony Marshall is trying to leave um, Sevilla trying to bid for him but 
still not working so we don't know what's happening to uh, Masia right now but the player has, has come out himself to say he would love to get a move out of the club so let's see what happens there yeah so yeah that's just it for the transfer windows for now keep giving you more updates as time goes on uh please um tell me in the comment section what um transfers you would like to see and um tell me the transfer business you have been happy with so far and then for your club tell me which player which move would you like to see happen in your club or any team at all okay please um share this video like and subscribe to this channel all right be good